Good morning, everyone. I'm Craig. And I'm Mel. And it is a beautiful, beautiful morning here at Disney's Old Key West Resort as we have breakfast reservations at Olivia's Cafe. Uh, pretty excited about this because we've eaten dinner at Olivia's but never breakfast. So why don't you come inside with us and enjoy a great breakfast. See you inside. So we just got seated here at Olivia's for breakfast. Um, one thing you'll notice from dinner, the difference is, it is full. Uh, almost every table that can be utilized is being utilized. Once again, great decor in here. You have all these pictures all over the walls. You have the seaside uh, theming. We're in a different room. There's uh, separate rooms. We're in a smaller room separated from the main dining area. But it's very nice. It's a nice restaurant. Uh, once again, very accommodating. Uh, we asked for chocolate chips on top of Connor's waffles. We got that. Uh, Mel asked for chocolate chips on top of her pancakes. We got that. So just very accommodating. Look forward to a great breakfast. This is the banana bread French toast that I got as an entree. And Melissa got the pancakes with eggs and bacon with the chocolate chips. And Connor got the Mickey waffles with sausage and one piece of bacon. And no chocolate chips, even though he asked for chocolate chips. So before she tries the pancake, I have to laugh because um, we asked for chocolate chips and they said, yeah, they could put some on top. Uh, so she lathered her melted chocolate chips all over her pancakes. Then when she cut into them, she realized, oh my goodness, they put chocolate chips all throughout the pancakes. So now there is a ton of chocolate on her pancakes. But she's going to give it a try and see how it is. I literally lathered chocolate all over the top of it. And then I cut in and it was like a whole mountain of chocolate in one spot. <laughs> so I actually put some on Connor's because he didn't get the chocolate chips. So it melted on his. So it worked out in the end. Pancakes are good. Chocolate is definitely helping because I can tell they don't have a lot of flavor to them and they seem a little bit overcooked. So overall, I recommend getting the chocolate chips. Just beware, there might be some inside. So let's try the eggs. I got scrambled eggs. And those are pretty good. I was happy that they actually brought salt and pepper because I don't always get that at restaurants and they're not too runny. So overall, Let's have a good flavor. Let's try the bacon. Mm. That's pretty good too. It's pretty crunchy. It's not greasy, which is really good for me. Um, but overall, I'm pretty satisfied. I might be on a sugar overload because we got chocolate milk to drink. But so far, I like the first couple bites. Like, see there. That's a lot of chocolate. That is a lot of chocolate. Mm -hmm. Quite as good. In case you needed to see all the chocolate, those are the least chocolatey pieces. I actually put the more chocolatey pieces on Connor's waffle and have just spread the chocolate around. So I got the banana bread French toast. I took a couple bites of it so far. It is amazing. It has such a good taste and flavor of banana. It's really good banana bread. When I got a little creative, uh, they gave a extra cup of chocolate chip for Connor, so save kind of for Connor. And I took a chocolate chip and I put it inside the banana bread French toast. So let's see how good that is. Mm. Honestly, I like that even more um, than the regular because it has the banana taste, it has the sweetness from this syrup that they put in, uh, the powdered sugar, and then a little bit of chocolate at the end. It's really a good breakfast. This is, might be one of my favorite breakfast dishes that I've had in property. This is really good. And the sausage itself is sitting in the syrup, which isn't like your typical maple syrup. It's a um, seems like a banana foster type sauce. Um, really good. So when you get that on the sausage, it gives it some extra sweetness. So you have the grill from the sausage, um, then the sweetness from the syrup. 
fantastic. Really a fantastic dish. Hey, Connor. What? What do you think of your breakfast? Here we go. Oh, look at this. It tastes 100% good. 100% good? Mm -hmm. That's a good review. Well, I can see because you have to lay, save some for later. How's the bacon? Good. Yeah, but you know, but that's not what else. Nah, that's not just what I'm gonna give you. Mm -hmm. Oh, two thumbs up. Connor gives it two thumbs up. Ladies and gentlemen, this has been a great breakfast as Connor's giving it two bouncy thumbs. So we just wrapped up our breakfast at Olivia's. Mel, what do you think of your breakfast? Yeah, overall, it was good. I will say it did take a while to get our food. I think it's maybe 25 minutes, which seemed like a lot because there weren't that yeah, there weren't that many people in there. So I got the pancakes, I asked for chocolate chips. Um, they did say, you'll just get chocolate chips on top. I said, you know what, that's fine. And I got scrambled eggs and bacon. So overall, the pancakes were pretty good. I think they were overcooked a little bit. They were pretty dark on top. Um, but I really couldn't see it because I rubbed all of the chocolate chips on the top because I thought those were the only chocolate chips I would get until I cut in and, and saw that there were probably 50 chocolate chips inside. Yeah. So it was really chocolatey. On a good note, since they did not put the chocolate chips on Connor's waffles, I gave him the really chocolatey chipped pieces and it worked out well. So in the end, I was pretty happy with the amount of chocolate that I got and my child got. Um, the eggs were pretty good, standard scrambled eggs. The bacon was probably some of the best bacon I've had because it wasn't, gris wasn't greasy, excuse me, and it was crispy, so crispy. Where it was well, going with it. I love crispy bacon. It's some of my favorite. Uh, I know. I ordered extra crispy. <laughs> um, Connor absolutely loved his kids' meal. Um, once we got some chocolate on his plate, he was pretty sad whenever he saw the waffles and there wasn't any chocolate on it. Um, but he enjoyed the bacon. He didn't really touch the sausage too right. much, but that's typical, typical. for him. Yeah, and I had the uh, banana bread French mm -hmm. toast, which it was very, very good. I didn't care as much for the pieces that were soaked in the rum mm -hmm. syrup. Um, that was just okay. Those, I mean, they were still good. It just wasn't as great as the like the outside of the bread that was harder. Um, it was really good banana bread, but just mm -hmm. a little overbearing sometimes with the syrup. Uh, just became too sweet. But overall, I kind of it was a fantastic breakfast. And if I was staying at Old Key West, I would definitely come to Olivia for breakfast. And even if you are having yourself a, a day where the park is opening later, make the trip over here to Old Key West and try Olivia's for breakfast. I don't think you'll be disappointed. You know what would be good with yours? Because the banana bread itself, just plain, was delicious. If you ask for the sauce on the side, I bet you they would do that, that you could put your amount on there that you want or just eat the banana bread itself because it was delicious. That's I did a good idea. That. Good call. Yeah, absolutely. But we hope you enjoyed today's video. Hope you found it informative. If you did, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We'd really appreciate it. And of course, hit the like button. Let's YouTube know that we're doing a great job. And as always, be on the lookout for new content and join us next time and we'll show you why we are loving this world. Bye everyone.